Hello everyone, I hope you're having a blessed day. About a year or so ago, I did a finger style version of um, A Thousand Hallelujahs. And um, I did do a lesson where I broke down the chorus, but people have been messaging me asking me to break down the rest of the song. So I'm going to show you how I played it. So you're going to capo first fret and um, Here's the intro. This is the electric guitar part. So what I'm doing is a C and I'm just plucking five, three, and two, hammering the pinky and then hitting the high E open. Then I move these down like this and I that's called a F major six. Then I just pluck them together, four, three, and two. And then hit the G and D string. And then back to that twice. Like that, so. Oh, and before I go to the F6, I hit the high E one more time. Right there, then. Repeat. Now, I add the low E when I start the verse. Like that. So, I'm plucking six, three, and two together. So after I pluck six, three, and two together, I go, hitting D, D, G, B, so, then I go to an F2 with a C bass, and then I do the same thing, then I hit that high string right there, so I go, Go to the C and I ax I hit the high E with it. And then I pull off here. So that's how I end it. time. Then I repeat. That time I don't do that, that pinky pull off. I accent the high E string is what's ringing. So second time. Okay. Then we go to an F. Okay, that's the next part. So what I'm doing there is I'm going, I'm plucking four, three, and two together on an F chord. Then I lift up and I hit the high E, which makes it an F major seven. So I go. So after I pluck all three together, I go. Four, two, three. High E. Then I go to a G and I'm accenting the the D note right there. So So I'm 
picking like that, I'm going six, two, and three together. Then I go D, G. So four, three, two, four, one. That's the picking. Then I go to a D minor seven. So D minor seven to a G. Then I strum the F. Then I go. Back to the C. Okay, so one more time on that part. Okay, now I'll play that whole section from the beginning to that part and then we'll tackle the chorus. So intro. Here we go, now verse. That's what we have so far. Now we go to the chorus. On the chorus, I'm playing, um, I'm playing this C shape. So this is your cage system. So like playing that C moving up to here and then barring, but I'm not utilizing the low string. So I don't really need to put it up there. I mean, you can, you can go, but I'm just accenting. I'm going four, two and one, then I'm picking up the chord. So I'm going, I hit the G and then up the chord, so. Then I go to a C and I'm accenting that high G. So I'm going, I take it off and I hit the high E to the B. So then to the G again, that G with the D. So what I'm doing there is I'm picking six, three, and two. And then I go from the D string down. So I go D, uh, four, three, one, two. So again, like that. And then I end on the C right there. Okay, so again. there on the C. Now on this one, I go to an A minor seven, but I'm adding this D right there. 
and I'm picking five, three, and two together. So, put it together, it goes like this, slow. Oh, I actually end on the G string, open G. So there I go, five, three, and two. And then one, two. So again. <laughs> Sorry, hold on. I'm doing is holding a G. I'm plucking six, two, and one together. And then I pick down the chord. Okay, one more time, slow. Repeat. This time, I don't go to that A minor 7. I hit the high E. I go. Then I go to a D minor 7. But I'm putting an A in the bass. So I'm plucking 5, 3, 2. And then I lift it up to get the high E in. So I go. Like that. Then there I go six, three, two. So like that. So One more time. Then I just strum an F. and then pick straight down it, so I go. And then I pick up the chord, so down the F, up the chord. So I'm going open E, so B, C, D, E, with the G bass. So, again, here we go. Okay, that's where we're at now. We just C, E minor, A minor 7 to the G. So we're going. So I'm just going. I'm picking, you know, you could pick two strings, you could pick three strings, it doesn't matter. Uh, but I'm going 5, 3, 2. 
then I go four, three, two. So then I go to an E and I'm picking six, three, two, and then picking the chord again. So every time I'm going four, three, two, when I pick the chord, after I pluck it together, so I'm going A minor seven, I'm picking five, three, two, and I'm picking, you know, the four, three, two again after I pluck them together. There I'm plucking six, three, two together, and then four, three, two. So coming out of this, So all together, this is what we have. That's where we're at so far. Now, F again. So. So on the F, we're going. I'm plucking four, three, uh, four, two, one. So I'm going four. Two, one. Then I go straight down the chord. I'm going three, two, one, two on the F chord. So. And then when I lift up, I lift up and I put the high E in. I change it to an F major seven and I hit one, two again on the string. So, so. Four, two, and one. Pick down the chord. So I go to a C with an E bass. G to the C. Okay, so here we go. Really slow again. Okay, then you just repeat.
Okay, now we get to the bridge. The bridge, the chords, we just pick straight down. We start with a C. So after we come out of that, minor so I, I mixed up the picking this is pretty much just straight down on the C then a C with an E bass Then I go to a F2 to that G with the with the D right there. One more time. The singing comes in. Praise. Okay, so what I'm doing there. The chords were the same, um, almost as the intro. So when we come into the same, we go, pray. We hit the high E before we go to the D minor. So now I'm, I'm plucking five, three, and two together. I'm going. To the high E, then to the D minor. And on that note, before I go to the C over E. So there I'm plucking six, two, and one, and I'm skipping the A string. So I'm going six, two, one, and I'm going four, three, two, one, two, three, four. So When I end it, I'm hammering uh, B to C, open, back to the C. So that's what I'm doing on that C over E. So again. Now we go F. So first time F, I'm plucking four, two, and one. And then after I pluck four, two, and one, I go two, three, four. Then I lift it up, I turn it to an F major seven, and I do the same thing. But that time, when I go the F major 7, I don't pluck the 4, 2, and 1 together. I just go 1, 2, 3, 4. So I go on the F, 4, 2, and 1. And then 2, 3, 4. So then I lift up, go the F major 7. I'm doing it with one finger so you can see it. <laughs> See, look. Six, two, 
So same thing with the G. So the F. I'm hitting six and one together with just the G note. And I'm going one, two, three, four. After I hit the two together. Then I go two, three, four, six. Two, three, four, six. So. Like that. Okay, one more time. I'll try to, I'm trying to tilt so you can see the picking hand because this is pretty much self-explanatory. I'm just going F, F major, G, and I'm adding the high D. So I'm going... repeat high E string D minor ending on the F C over E I'm ending on the C on there Now we go to an A minor. And then we end on the high E before we go to G over B. So I'm just picking straight down the chord. I'm picking five, three, and two together. When I go to the A minor, I'm going. So, four, three, two, three. G over B. I'm plucking five, three, and two. I hit the F before I go to the next chord, so. C. I'm plucking, when I go to the C, I go 5, 2, and 1. That's that thing again that we did on the last one. Because we're going to go. Okay, so A minor. F, the high F. That's basically the whole song. Then goes back into the chorus. So now I'll play it a, a little bit up to tempo. I'll play through the chorus only. Uh, I'll play through the chorus and I'll go into the bridge and then I'll end it. Okay, so here we go.
So there you go. Uh, if you want my chord chart, I'll send it to you. Um, I try to break it down as much as I can and slow it down as much as I can. As I always tell you guys, when I'm finger picking, I'm not always necessarily playing the strings or picking the strings the exact same way every time. The, the concept is you always want to make sure, you know, that you're in timing. That's the key. So, you know, start out with a metronome really slow and, you know, break it down. Get the, you know, the, the dynamics of it down first. Then you can start speeding up. And however you want to uh, pick, as long as the timing's right, that's all that matters. And, of course, you want the melody to kind of be consistent so you can hear, you know, the vocal line that we're playing. So, uh, again, if you have any questions, you can reach out to me. I always leave my email in the description. If you're not a subscriber and you like what you see, hit subscribe and leave any comments. I always get back to you guys, okay? So, hope you have a great Sunday tomorrow. And God bless you, and remember to glorify God with your gifts and talents.